Okay, guys. This group of soldiers has been isolated from their squad. Let's see if we can offer them a hand. Or a knife. According to my notes, there's a radio in the little house. When the situation's under control, we'll use a radio to inform headquarters. I'd sure like to find out what's inside those boxes. All right, so I think uh, the guys, our soldiers, set up the mission quite nicely there. This is going to be a two-part mission, actually. First off, we need to take care of everybody in this area, and there's quite a lot of them, as you can see. Let me highlight them. Also, lots of interesting boxes lying around, like this one. This one, and I think there is an important box inside here as well. And then, after we take care of everybody, there's going to be an invasion uh, starting, like the second wave of enemies is gonna come, along with the tank even, which is gonna be quite interesting, and we're gonna have to take care of everybody else as well. Now though, let's start small, let's take care of these guys first. Alright, these four guys down here need to go. That's the first one we need to take care of, and uh, I don't think the officer can see that far, nicely. This guy is of concern, so I'm gonna use Tiny here who is our resident knife expert. Let's go as close as we can. No. Let's, go, huh? Let's save before we do anything. No, that was stupid. <laughs> I actually wanted to use the knife. It's usually control, but not the first time you do it, I guess. You first have to put out the knife and then you can use it with control using the uh, keyboard key control, I mean. I right, wait for that guy to look away. All right, quickly go. By the way, do not run towards enemies when you're about to knife them because they will turn around and uh, maybe they have enough time to shoot at you and sound the alarm. So try and take it slow maybe there. For now, now I'm gonna go behind this guy. Is that a wise move? Do I have enough time or will he see me? Let's see. That was a bad move. <laughs> ah, see, I told you. It pays to be patient. All right, let's do that again. Piece of cake. Good. A good piece of advice is saving the, the game, quick saving after every enemy kill, which is what I didn't do. And I kind of paid Leave for it. it. So this time, I'm gonna be quick save the game instead. Uh -huh. and then I'm gonna crouch the rest of the way. Okay. I'm gonna wait for this guy to look away. He kinda does his thing here. He punches the wall because he's angry or something. <laughs> and as soon as he does that, Good. now we're gonna kill this guy. So you can see timing is of the essence in this game. Well, obviously, it being a strategy stealth game, this you probably guessed that. Let's get some bullets here. All right, next up, uh -huh. let's go for that guy down here. Uh -huh. I'm going to crouch because when they engage in conversation, I'm kind of worried maybe this guy can see him. Uh -huh. All right, now let's wait it out a bit. Wait for him to start punching the wall again. This is mine. I'm gonna grab him. I'm gonna stick to the lower part of the screen here because you cannot see that far. Nice. Excellent. This is mine. I'm gonna hold a bit of uh, some weapons here and then I'm probably gonna divide them among my soldiers to prepare ourselves for the second wave of invasion. Oh, now hold on. Uh -huh. Now let's crouch, wait for this guy to look away. I'm gonna hide behind this wall and take him out. Point away, sir. Okay. 
I could actually just take care of him right now. Hold on. Yeah, let's do this in, uh, like, as quick as we can. Watch for this soldier, though. He kind of goes up and down. Leave it he might me. catch you of surprise. By surprise. These keys that the officer carries, very important. Take them as well. These open this uh, house here. All right, now I'm going to use the decoy, maybe. Let's place it here. I can probably open it right away. Boys. Attract somebody's attention. Oh, interesting. He didn't come running. Aha. Can I punch this guy, maybe? Let's see. Oh, he saw me. <laughs> Bad move. Let's do that again. I wonder why he didn't hear my decoy. Good. Good. Oh, now the officer comes. Nice. Okay. Cool. That works as well. I'm gonna wait for him to uh, look the other way a bit. Leave it to me. All right, I quickly gather up the equipment and the officer. And now we're gonna kill this guy. He's gonna stand over here. I think that's uh, within punching range. Or even knifing range. If you've uh, no idea what I'm talking about here. You can kind of hear the sound. Other enemies can hear you when uh, punching or knifing people. If you punch somebody, the uh, sound range is very low. If you knife somebody, it's, uh, it's a bit higher. So you should probably punch people if you're in a tight spot. This is mine. All right, now this guy should be the easiest. Good. Yeah, nobody's watching this guy. Oh, maybe this guy. Oh, hold on. Will he see me? No. Thankfully. Okay, cool. We're still fine. All right, now maybe is a good time to regroup our, uh, our troops here. Let's bring okay. everybody here. Bring them closer to the action. All right, and... I'm ready, sir. Now... Oh, maybe... You okay. know what? Let's give somebody else some weapons. Yeah, he can take some arms as well. Why not? Phew. Yeah. I'm gonna try and use Tiny to kill this soldier. These guys cannot see that far, so we're fine. This guy is a nuisance, though. Have to watch out for him. Leave it to me. Uh -huh. uh, let's see how far away can these guys see. I don't think these guys can see me at all right now. Yeah, this guy's probably looking, yeah, okay. totally someplace else. So now I can just casually stand up, uh -huh. quickly go to this guy and knife him. I will have to be fairly fast, though. This guy can see me. Hold on. I don't like that. Hold on. Let's wait for this guy to, yes, kind of look away. And now I have to be fast, bring this guy down before the officer come ba comes back running. As he can see me from that uh, balcony over there. Leave it to me. All right, let's now right. give Tread maybe some guns. All right, now everybody has a carbine. Very nice. And this, I think this is a good spot to actually save the game for reals. Let's name this one, maybe. All right, now we need to kill this officer. He's very much a problem. Good. All right, now let's see. Whoops. Hold on. Okay. Right, I think this is actually... actually have a shot here. Excellent. Now, let's just hide him over here. Nobody is ever going to look behind this place, I think. Does he have anything interesting? No. Uniforms do not play a role right now. I can pick them up, but only the spy can use them, which is not part of my team right now. All right, so now comes the fun part, I guess. <laughs> Lots of enemies isolated. Nobody is looking at each other, as I can kind of demonstrate here. All right, so uh, I can just Easy. casually go and kill everybody, I think. Just don't make the mistake of running. 
because that makes a sound. Coin. Uh-huh. And always approach from the backside, obviously. Don't like stab them in the face. <laughs> uh -huh. That is not good. Alright. Let's bring up the rest of our team. Now there's only three enemies remaining. Only these guys. And I think they can't even see me now because they're looking elsewhere. Let's go. Oh wow, that was a that was a risky route to take. <laughs> There is actually an enemy here in the window, and they passed right in front of him. That was uh, <laughs> Tell me. that was not wise, but all right. Let's uh, get some bullets, maybe. Okie dokie. All right, you take some too, sir. Probably not gonna need them Phew. if I set this up correctly, but just in case. All right, now this box. Let's see. Are right, a lot of cocktails. Those are usable by thread. Small grenades as well, usable by thread. Grenades, though. Okay. That is uh, in furnace area of expertise. Let's give him that. Phew. All right, let's go take care of the uh, last remaining enemies now. These three guys over here. Only this guy is of concern. The other guys have like fixed visions. You can see they never look anywhere else. So that's fine. Only this guy is a nuisance. So I'm gonna maybe stick around here for a while. Wait for this guy to do one more round. And then kill everybody. See, I'm remaining in the uh, light green area. Now I'm gonna go a bit closer. I'm not gonna do anything because they're very close to each other and they can hear anything I do. As soon as this guy goes, though, I'm gonna knife this one. This is mine. Nice. And now, if I knife this one, the other one will hear it, but if I punch him, that is much less audible. See? This guy didn't hear it. And obviously Boy. knife the last one. Also, pro tip, do not forget enemies like that. Uh, he's still alive, and if the other enemies come in the second wave, they will release him. Always kill anybody, everybody, because there's not really Boy. a penalty to that. Alright, some medicine and some food as well, I think, right? Food, yes, which also serves as medicine. It's kind of the same thing. Right, let's get some bullets as well, why not? Agreed. All right, and now... Now we're gonna enter the uh, second part of this mission, I guess. Aha! Uh -huh. Now let's enter this area. We have the key, as you can see. We looted that from the officer downstairs. All right, so now we have two enemies in here. They're actually in quite close range, so do not attempt to knife the first one. The other one will hear it. Just punch whichever you choose to punch first. I could take his bullets even. And then the second guy, you can just knife casually. I think it's an officer as well. No. Anything useful on him? Nope. All right, let's uh, use the radio to contact our allies, and that is going to trigger the second part of the mission. We have intercepted a transmission. A group of enemies is fast approaching your position. An enemy tank has received orders to exterminate you all. Defend your position. And destroy that tank. Wow, an enemy tank has received orders to exterminate you. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I think there's an important box here somewhere. Yeah, there you can see it. This is mine. Because it contains, yes, explosives. Uh, explosives are not usable by Tiny, though. Uh -huh. That's the guy I'm using now. So let's uh -huh. bring in the, uh, let's bring in Inferno. He's like the heavy explosives That's expert. It. So we have two things. We have two anti-tank mines. By the way, that means these do not work against uh, simple soldiers. Like, uh, they will just ignore them. They only explode when they sense a vehicle over them. These, however, these are remote explosives. We can use these to whatever, for whatever reason, we want to. Alright, now it's a good time to do a hard save.
because we're gonna trigger the second part of the mission. As you can see, there is like the symbol here. Whenever I click that, the invasion, the enemy invasion starts. Before we do that, though, let's quickly set the stage of what we're gonna do. Yeah. Now, uh, let's see. Tiny. I'm gonna use Tiny as a safety measure. Enemies are gonna come running through this area. I'm gonna use the trick. I'm gonna have him hide in plain sight. He can dig a hole. And then I'm gonna let enemies pass. And if anybody remains here, I will use uh, Tiny to stab him on the backside. The other two members of our team are gonna be much more important though, especially, work. especially Inferno. Right, so Inferno, first of all, should place two anti-tank mines. That's it. Let's place them around here, maybe. I think the tank is gonna come uh, along this road. So no I'm just problem. gonna cover a bit of a wider area. And there's gonna be a slew of soldiers okay. rushing in. That's where I'm gonna use this mine. Let's see, I'm thinking. Let's use it, uh, I don't know, maybe here. Yes, sir. Let's not let the enemies get too close to us. And then I'm gonna hide. That's it. Hide this guy here behind this wall. Because remember, no problem. he also has some grenades that he can use. Let's see what the range is. So you can see we can kind of cover in a decent area. So if that bomb doesn't take out everybody in the first try, we can still use some grenades. Now, I can imagine. let's also take some uh, precautions. Correct. I'm going to use the driver to set up a few traps to protect my uh, protect the inferno here. He does have this, uh, what is this called even? I don't know, this tripwire, I guess. My turn. If an enemy soldier steps on that, he doesn't die, but he comes uh, becomes unconscious. Unconscious, okay. so that's one measure we're gonna take. And also he has this shovel. He can use it like three times. And if an enemy steps on uh, the oh hole my. he digs, he instantly dies. So this is much more, uh, much more useful. All right, now hold on. It's actually... Correctamundo. I have still two shovel uses. I'm gonna actually use them up here, maybe. Let's see if we can uh, take care of uh, some soldiers. All right, let's maybe place one, I don't know. I over like here, maybe. It. And, I don't know, another one over there. Let's uh, cover the bases for anybody who comes diagonally to this, uh, this side. Also, okay. I'm gonna use... Uh, thread to cover this area it's another thing you can do it's all mine. you can order your guys to cover an area i'm gonna have him sit all down ready. crouch down and aim towards this side so if anybody comes rushing trying to kill us from this side thread is gonna take care of him and i think we're kind of ready all right let's use this angle maybe this looks like the most useful one or is it this one this one is actually a bit more useful I think. Now, nah, let's go with this one. All right, now. Let's quick save. Let's launch the invasion. And we're going to no. switch to the uh, to the supper. As soon as enemies, a lot of enemies are around here, I'm going to trigger this explosive device. And if anybody remains, I can use my grenades as well. I'm going to see a slew of enemies rushing now. As soon as we're done with the enemies, the tent tank is going to come. All right, hold on. Let's wait for them. Ready. All right, that was a good bomb. Now grenades. It's done. Oh, actually. All right. Oh, wait. Wow, wow. Forgot. Hold on. <laughs> I was kind of watching the action and I forgot to take care of this enemy. Now the tank is going to come, I think. But we do have two anti-tank mines, so that should take care of that. Yes, here it comes. Uh, we will step on both of them, probably. Yes, excellent. And that's the mission.